I am here with Jonathan Torrens. This is a magical award. How does it feel to win this Canadian Screen Award? I'm gonna tell you something, and I'm only gonna tell you. Okay. I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at the Canadian Screen Awards in downtown Toronto. I am here with Jonathan Torrens. How does it feel to be nominated this evening for your work on Mr. D? I'm going to tell you something. If you make a living at working in the arts in Canada, you've already won. 5% yeah. of people that work in the arts in Canada do that solely for a living. Mm -hmm. So not to sound all mushy, but I really like that all the networks have been working together on things like the fan zone and working together to build a star system. I was thinking about it as I was in the shower and it's fun to be competitive, but to be supportive is imperative. Absolutely. And the only way that the industry will be strong is if all of us support each other. So my fellow nominees tonight, everyone that works in Canadian TV, I'm so proud of us because uh, there is temptation in other parts of the world, but to stay here and actually carve it out and try to make it happen is awesome. Absolutely. And Mr. D has a, uh, 10 nominations, I believe, yeah. at the CSA. So how does it feel to have that much, you know, uh, applause or I don't know the word. I'm well, I think <laughs> most of us who, who perform just want to do that for a living. So I think all of us, without exception, would trade the 10 nominations for a fifth season. Yeah. We just want to do it again. Yeah. It's not like I can take a CSA nomination to the bank. <laughs> um, we just like making the show. It's really fun. It's a nice group of people. It's Bankers Hours. It's in Halifax in the summertime. There's a lot to love about it. Um, and for you shooting out on the East Coast, that must be so great because you're amazing. from there. I get to sleep in my own bed every night. And um, like I said, work with a great group of folks. So I, I just really hope it goes again. Great. Well, thank you so much and best of luck this evening. Katie, do me a favor. Yes. Take care. Okay, I will. Thank you. You too. Nice to see you. <laughs> and I am here with Jonathan Torrens. A magical award. How does it feel to win this Canadian Screen Award? I'm going to tell you something, and I'm only going to tell you. Okay. You have these conversations with yourself from the time you're nominated, where you say it, it's an honor to just be nominated, and that's true. This was a little trickier for me because I work on Call Me Fitz with Peter McNeil, who was also nominated in the category, and he's awesome. So had he won, I genuinely would have been tickled for him. You never imagine you're going to hear your name, but um, there's always a little part of you that thinks, I wonder, is tonight the night for me? Yeah. So it, it was a real thrill, I won't lie. It, I wish it meant less than it does. <laughs> well, you deserve it. Congratulations, and enjoy the rest of the evening. Thank you so much.